night we are here with the charts and we are going to do this market update no intro necessary so as you can see we are here with bitcoin and bitcoin has been following this trend line of reversing so we have a possible reversal here forming now now until we break above this line here this uh resistance that's been here for quite some time since the high of 69,000, we um I haven't broke this support as or resistance as you can see um and we also haven't broke this support other than in this capitulation wick wick over here so as you can see basically bitcoin is very very predictable at this point we've been following this threads this uh channel down and until we touch the top trend line break past it and then maybe retest it or just break past it and break out of it i will not say this is a reversible as you can see this is a very clear bullish pattern we have this inverse head and shoulders breakout here and that broke us out to this high and we are forming a new higher high over here so we have higher highs and higher lows so as of now this is technically a reversal but i would not put full confirmation until we break above this steady line of resistance that we have been dealing with for quite some time and that is basically going to indicate everything for the following crypto markets as you can see we have um the fear and greed index um slightly rising um so it's still indicating a buy opportunity but um it might be slipping out of the buy opportunity as we start to climb higher and higher so if you can afford to buy now i would definitely say is the time to buy even if we dip lower you still have a low entry and you can still buy the bottom if you have capital on the side but it does look like an indicative of bottom with the high volume notes we have um social analytics going through the roof which also can mark a bottom we have volume on the charts marking a bottom we have a bullish crossover on the macd we have rsi oversold all this stuff indicates the indication of a possible bottom for crypto in the crypto markets and if you go ahead and look at the stock markets which has been highly correlated with the crypto markets and also the dollar which um when the dollar pumps assets dump and when the dollar um dumps assets pump you can see the dollar starting to trend down here as it hit its head on resistance and it's starting to trend down and if you look at the nasdaq nasdaq is green up over three percent and that is this almost the same for the spy um or spy so as you can see we have several green days here on the general market which have been highly correlated to crypto and seeming to show a bottom with this double bottom here which is also a bullish in uh structure as well um forming an indication of even higher highs even higher than we seen back in 2020 before the crash if you go ahead and look at AMC we have um this double bottom playing out very very clear which I marked in my last video which um is very very indicative which everything is basically correlated with the markets right now we have these high volume notes marking the bottoms if you notice volume bottom volume bottom you don't really want to look at things unless they have volume to support them it's very very important if a move has a lot of volume to support them to the up or the down side um that's how you can find tops or bottoms and then aligning it with RSI as you can see RSI is oversold oversold you can also find tops or bottoms and then using the MACD so using all of these indications we can see that it is very obvious that this is a bottom we're looking at multiple different stocks we're looking at multiple different assets and we can see that all of them are rallying all of them are pretty much correlated right now and that's because the same people invest in the same things but as you can see it is clear this is most likely the bottom we retested these levels on multiple assets in whatever asset you're in right now um you probably seen similar structures double bottom oversold territory um high volume notes on these bottom marks marking an indicative of a reversal so what well, basically the structure is showing us that it was a buy opportunity to buy the dip and that might not always be the case because you can catch a falling knife but it's it's hard to pick tops or bottoms so what you can do is try to buy 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 
down on the down move, so buy along the down trend, increasing your chances by dollar cost averaging in, and then waiting for the move up higher. And as you can see on multiple assets, we're having this double bottom and this falling wedge um, structure. So we're having a falling wedge, double bottom structure on multiple assets. It's very, very clear. A lot of them are correlated. But hopefully you found the video informative if you did go ahead and drop a like subscribe for more content and as you can see this is your general market update with the dollar we have crypto we have amc we have the spy nasdaq all of that good stuff here for you so hopefully you found the video informative go ahead and drop a like subscribe for more content and as always have fun stay safe keep hacking make money peace out